Right, hello everybody, welcome to game number 10 of Never Give Up. Um, up against Cheney, maybe. Um, he's got a starting Necro team. This team probably worse than a starting <laughs> Chorf team. Now, nah, I got the re-roll. I'm not sure everyone's got some guard. It's, uh, it's not terrible, but there are only five. There are only five Chorfs. And there's a bit of fan factor. Um, so yeah, it's uh, it's not as easy as it could be. <laughs> it's like, I think with a 13th player, like 13 players and 6... What I really want is 6 chaffs and 13 players. And then I feel like you can foul a bit and you've got quite a lot of insurance against bad luck. Whereas I think with 11... 11 chaffs, you're, you're in a really in a really precarious position of, you know, them casting some hobgoblins easily. Or like, you're really stretched if they cas chaffs. Whereas with, with 13, and even with 12, but with 13 you've got, you're in pretty solid then, aren't you? <laughs> Ball shot time. Unbelievable, isn't it, Skuro? Unbelievable, Father Skuro. <laughs> Alright, it's only the wizard. I, I think I'd rather him have wizard for one turn than Cheney for 16. But the reroll's a decent choice, I think. <laughs> yes, Despo. Oh, <laughs> pimp on pew. Is it over 85%? No, I'm not. It's definitely below 85%. Even if I win this one, we're at 80%. Fantastic, Tom Schneers. Living the dream. Living the absolute dream. <laughs> That's brilliant, that. <laughs> if you go to the Discord in my, uh, if you go to the Blood Bowl channel in my Discord, it's pretty funny. Yeah, so only got eleven men, but he's only got eleven men too. But yeah, I think that's the thing. I think having thirteen men would be really nice. Give you that reliability. Reliability. Ten games from Jim, yeah. I know Zoom, neither can I, yeah. Crazy, you know. Hopefully it's a sign of things to come. Hopefully I can keep doing going because you know. <laughs> Battle Brothers doesn't pay the bills. <laughs> But I mean, I do love Blood Bowl as well, it's not just that, obviously. Yeah, Adev, yeah, I, 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 I'm rather, I'm rather he has the wizard for one turn. That's what I said, I don't know if I made it clear, but I'm, I'm happy he has the wizard, I would rather he has the wizard for one turn than he has Cheney for 16. <laughs> I would rather, I would have taken Cheney. But then the the extra reroll is good for him, because um, that gives him three rerolls, which is pretty pretty good. Like two rerolls is really really thin, isn't it? So so th getting the third reroll is pretty is a pretty good shout actually. Ah, oh, thanks very much, Martin Scorsese. That's nice. Another ghoulist team. What is it with these people and not taking the fucking best player on the team? What the fuck, man? <laughs> no, of course it's not. 
bad thing. I mean, depending on how you feel about Blood Bowl, I guess it might be a bad thing. <laughs> Yeah, true Muppet, yeah. yeah. Yeah, the wolf with its zero plus dodge arts. They never ever fail, ever. I literally think a rookie ghoul is a better player than a rookie wolf. Genuinely believe it. <laughs> Fair enough, man. <laughs> I'm not even memeing. I think if you take TV out of the equation, like, you know, disregarding the fact you get an extra 50 TV, even if a werewolf was 70 TV. I still think the goo is better. There you go. It's because Frenzy's like a nega trait, isn't it, basically? Until you've got the guard and stuff to back it up. Until you've got block. Like once you've got block on the on the <laughs> on the on the wolf, it starts to overtake it. But um but as far as rookies go... He can punch, he can blitz, and he can punch, but what does this guy do? I guess he just goes back. I blitz with mighty blow. Therefore, Mr. Page thinks I know how to play. Woo! Fucking good, but fun. Oh, nice. Maybe I should have put the hob up there and the bull down here. That was a great turn, wasn't it? Removal and a stun. Wonderful. Yeah, I like I like the bulls being split up. I think if you have a one, you know, a one bull in one zone, the other bull should be in the other zone. So in this case, one on each side. One goes chasing the ball, the other one should stay back or whatever. <laughs> yeah, indeed, cocky. Yeah, <laughs> indeed. It's cool that there's some people who like the Battle Brothers, like, but I don't know. I got a bit, I got a bit pissed off with it last time. Like, I feel like once you've mastered it, there's not, there's nothing more to it, you know, apart from dicking around unnecessarily. <laughs> Beautiful frenzy trap for himself there, wasn't it? It was a 2 and a 1. There's the dodge out. It's failed. What? What? No, it's, of course it doesn't fail. 
<laughs> Whiff ball. <laughs> <laughs> like it's still totally exposed. Unbelievable. <laughs> I don't know, Father Scoobal. <laughs> it's not fucking good, I know that. <laughs> This is a solid baked potato here. Oh, if only. Hey. <laughs> Wonderful. Some bloody dice rolls here, aren't they? I, I want to do all that to free him up so that I don't have to pick up the ball at the, you know, at the, at that, at that moment if I, if I get the power. And obviously if the ball goes in the crowd, which it could. And oh my god. <laughs> and I would have Crazy, isn't it? That's crazy. That is some good dice rolls. <laughs> Phone on the police. I know, right? Oh dear. I guess I don't want him to make some stupid dodges through and surf me. So even though this last GFI is, is bad, I know it's technically a bad GFI, I've got the fourth reroll for it, and it does stop any threat of him getting surfed. Wonderful. Because he could have, he could have like bolted this guy and served him, couldn't he? Something like that. Yeah. If I, if I just stood there, then uh, then he could have bolted and, and gone through and served. So. Yes, Jovanian. The plan is ten day, ten games on day one, ten games on day two, ten games on day three. Ten games on day four. Would have been easier if any fucker had conceded to me. <laughs> si le joueur trébuchant du terrain, il finira dans les tribunes. Et connaissant les fans de Blood Bowl, ce Oh yeah, he did concede, yeah, he did concede. Okay, one did concede. I tell a lie. One did concede. Oh my god, full 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 frenzy trap. <laughs> One into minus two. E. I was gonna say I'd just take the push there anyway, so I can surf his fucking wolf. <laughs> I wasn't even gonna pick the skull. <laughs> he wasted his reroll because I wasn't even gonna pick the fucking skull. <laughs> Yeah, that's true here, Dave. That's true. Right, now obviously I could surf him and then surf him as well. That'd be very greedy, wouldn't it? And not the sort of thing 
Jim would be advised would advise anybody to do. Um, ever. Very greedy. Do not try this at all. That's a 1D because I didn't do it with the bull centaur. <laughs> I was going to do it with the bull centaur and I thought, ooh, I can do it with the, uh, I can do it with this guy instead. There was a reason why I was going to do it with the bull centaur and it's because he's strength 4. There you go. Doesn't matter, they both work, therefore I was the best. If I lose this game, I can go to diced or not, and uh, I will know. I will know that it was just my uh, sheer bad luck that caused me to lose, and not being a complete fucking idiot. Um, so you know, there you go. Uh, I was definitely right. I'm the best. Four. <laughs> I was stupid as fuck, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> to be fair to me, it's pretty fucking late. To be fair, it's pretty fucking late. It's not my fault. And I'm new to Blood Bowl. So. <laughs> yeah, it's three fucking AM. <laughs> I'm sorry, Muppet. <laughs> I'm sorry, we'll put quarter past three even, never mind three. This is game number ten, yeah. We are ten and a half hours into the stream. <laughs> it's not my fault. Look, dicedonot.com. It's uh, nothing to do with me. Uh, it was just bad luck. Didn't even matter luck. In fact, that might have got the <laughs> that might have got the concession. <laughs> that idiotic one die surf might have been the tipping point. <laughs> Fucking idiotic surf <laughs> might have been like, what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> oh dear. Oh yes, MVP for him. Lovely jubbly. I mean, to be fair, he was he was shat on there. He was absolutely like that was really lucky for me, really lucky. Like as well as it being like obviously stupid being two hundred and fifty TV down, that was a really really unlucky, uh, really unlucky game for him. I hate guard claw, but hey, it is what it is. Yeah, he's an SPP hog, but it, winning isn't it? Winning's the most important thing, but that. At the end of the day, when you start on three fucking draws, because you you can't pick up the fucking ball, you've got to uh, <laughs> you've got to do something, which is uh, you know try to maximise your chances of winning, haven't you? So there you go. Here is Muppet Pac-Man. Speak of the devil. And now, of course, I would have quite liked a dirty player. Um. <laughs> yeah, you do, you do. Yeah, like, that's the thing in it. Guard Claw is just nasty, and it takes you so long to get Mighty Blow on him. And he's like just worse than Mighty Blow Guard for so long. And he's more TV than Mighty Blow Guard, and he's worse than Mighty Blow Guard. And it takes him so long to get the piling on as well. And it's like, it's pretty rotten, but hey. Um, there you go, 6 4 0. Wonderful start of the season. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.